The USS Michael Mansour, DDG-1001, stands at the pinnacle of naval warfare innovation. As the second ship of the Zumwalt-class destroyers, it boasts advanced technologies, unprecedented stealth capabilities, and cutting-edge weapon systems, making it one of the most formidable warships ever built. Named after Navy SEAL Michael Mansour, a Medal of Honor recipient, the ship honors his sacrifice while embodying the future of the U.S. Navy's combat capabilities. Designed to execute multi-mission warfare, including anti-air, anti-submarine, and land attack missions, the USS Michael Mansour is a technological marvel that plays a critical role in modern naval strategy. With its sleek, stealthy design, powerful armaments, and innovative propulsion systems, this destroyer represents a major leap forward in how the Navy conducts surface combat operations. The most striking feature of the USS Michael Mansour is its stealth design. The ship's hull, with its tumble home profile, slopes inward, significantly reducing its radar cross-section. This means the ship appears much smaller on enemy radar than its actual size, making it difficult to detect. In combat, this ability to remain invisible to enemy radar gives the Michael Mansour a strategic advantage allowing it to get closer to hostile forces without being spotted. The materials used in its construction, combined with its angular sloped surfaces, enhance its radar evading capabilities. Additionally, the ship's heat and acoustic signatures have been minimized, making it more difficult to detect with infrared and sonar. This combination of low observability technologies makes the USS Michael Mansour one of the stealthiest warships in the world, capable of conducting missions in heavily contested areas with reduced risk of detection. At 610 feet, 186 meters long, the USS Michael Mansour is one of the largest destroyers in the US Navy with a beam of 80.7 feet, 24.6 meters, and a displacement of 15,600 tons. Despite its size, the ship's radar signature is comparable to that of a small fishing boat, making it a ghost on the water. One of the most revolutionary features of the USS Michael Mansour is its integrated power system, IPS. This all-electric propulsion system generates enough energy not only to power the ship, but also to support future energy-intensive weapons such as railguns and directed energy weapons like lasers. The IPS uses two Rolls-Royce MT-30 gas turbines, each generating 36 megawatts of power, and two RR4500 turbine generators, which produce 3.8 megawatts each. Together, these systems produce a total of 78 megawatts of electricity, enough to power a small city. The USS Michael Mansour is capable of reaching speeds of over 30 knots, 35 miles per hour or 56 kilometers per H, making it one of the fastest ships in its class. The combination of high speed, stealth, and advanced power systems ensures the Michael Mansour can be rapidly deployed to hotspots around the globe. The USS Michael Mansour is equipped with some of the most advanced weapons in the Navy's arsenal. Its vertical launch system contains 80 cells that can be loaded with a variety of missiles, including Tomahawk cruise missiles for long-range strikes, standard missiles for air defense and missile defense, and evolved Sea Sparrow missiles to counter aerial threats. The ship also features the advanced gun system, with two 155mm naval guns that can fire at targets up to 70 miles away. These guns provide crucial long-range support during land attacks, though alternatives are being explored due to the high cost of the specialized ammunition. For close defense, the Phalanx Close-In Weapon System serves as the last line of protection, capable of rapidly shooting down incoming threats like missiles or small boats. Combined with its anti-submarine warfare capabilities, the USS Michael Mansour is designed to handle multiple types of threats across all domains. The USS Michael Mansour 
is named in honor of Master at Arms Second Class Michael Mansoor, a Navy SEAL who displayed extraordinary heroism during combat operations in Iraq. On September 29, 2006, Mansoor and his SEAL team were engaged in a firefight with insurgents in Ramadi when an enemy grenade was thrown into their sniper position. Mansoor, without hesitation, threw himself on the grenade, sacrificing his life to save his teammates. His selfless act earned him the Medal of Honor, and his name is now immortalized in the USS Michael Mansoor. The ship's motto, I will defend, embodies Mansoor's courage and commitment to protecting his fellow sailors and the mission. Every sailor aboard the ship carries the weight of this legacy, knowing that they serve on a vessel named after a true American hero. While the USS Michael Mansoor, DDG-1001, and USS Zumwalt, DDG-1000, are both Zumwalt-class destroyers, there are some key differences between the two ships. As the second ship in the class, the Michael Mansoor benefits from lessons learned during the construction and early operational experiences of the Zumwalt. One of the primary differences lies in the ship's focus on specific missions. The USS Zumwalt was designed with a heavy emphasis on literal combat and land attack, making it a versatile platform for operations close to shorelines. The USS Michael Mansoor while still capable of literal combat, has been optimized for multi-mission warfare, including surface warfare, anti-air operations, and land strikes. This shift in mission focus makes the Michael Mansoor a more flexible and capable platform in diverse combat scenarios. Additionally, upgrades in combat systems and electronics were implemented during the construction of the Michael Mansoor, based on the early feedback from the Zumwalt. These improvements make the Michael Mansoor a more refined and reliable warship, ensuring it can operate at peak efficiency during long deployments. Despite these differences, both ships share the same cutting-edge stealth technology, electric propulsion systems, and advanced weapons, making them formidable assets in the Navy's fleet. The USS Michael Mansoor represents a significant investment in the future of naval warfare. The total cost of constructing the ship is estimated at around $4.24 billion, reflecting the immense amount of technology and innovation built into the vessel. The overall Zumwalt class program, initially planned to include 32 ships, was scaled back to just three due to the high costs involved in developing the new technology. However, the Navy views the Zumwalt class, including the Michael Mansoor, as a long-term investment. These ships are designed to operate for decades with the capability to integrate future systems and weapons that will keep them at the forefront of naval warfare. The flexibility provided by the integrated power system means the Michael Mansoor can easily accommodate future upgrades such as directed energy weapons and hypersonic missiles ensuring it remains a dominant force on the battlefield for years to come. One of the key technologies that enhances the USS Michael Mansoor's operational capabilities is the VBAT-118, an unmanned aerial vehicle, UAV, designed for vertical takeoff and landing, VTOL operations. The VBAT-118 is a versatile, tail-sitting drone capable of launching from the small flight deck of the USS Michael Mansoor without the need for a runway or large support equipment. The VBAT-118 can carry various payloads, including electro-optical slash infrared cameras, providing real-time surveillance in winds and reconnaissance for the ship. With a flight endurance of up to eight hours, the VBAT-118 can significantly extend the ship's operational reach, offering critical intelligence in environments where traditional manned aircraft may be impractical or vulnerable to enemy fire. The USS Michael Mansoor, DDG-1001, is the embodiment of the U.S. Navy's commitment to innovation and technological superiority. With its stealth capabilities, advanced weapons systems, 
and the ability to integrate future technologies. The Michael Mansour stands as one of the most lethal and adaptable warships in the world. From its tribute to a fallen hero, to its cutting edge power and propulsion systems, the USS Michael Mansour represents the future of naval warfare. As the Navy continues to adapt to new threats and challenges, the USS Michael Mansour will play a critical role in maintaining America's naval dominance. Whether conducting surface warfare, land attacks, or deploying unmanned systems like the VBAT-118, this destroyer is a versatile and powerful platform that will ensure the Navy is prepared for the battles of tomorrow.